hi everyone welcome back to my channel today i'm going to show you how i made this afro wig i'm really excited so please stay tuned if you want to know how to make your own wig So you're going to need a head dummy, you're going to also need a weaving cup and you're also going to need a crochet needle for this process. I decided to use the braid temptation number two which I have already shown another video where I used it to crochet it on my natural hair because it looks really natural. I'm going to separate the strands before I start but I cut the braid into two because it's long enough. So for the method that I used, you just insert the needle, then you place the hair on the crochet hook, close the hook and pull it down, then you're going to pass the two strands between the loop that you have created. This is a simpler method for this particular braid because it tends to tangle up as you continue. So ensure as that as you crochet, you're going to leave space between the strands that you're making so that it's not too congested. So for the back part, I'm going to cut the braid into four to achieve a shorter length. And I'm just going to repeat the method where I insert the needle, place the braid onto the hook, pull it back, and then insert the two strands in between the loop that I created before tightening it. So as you continue, make sure that the next line that you start the braiding process, you do it between the space that you left between the crochet. This will enable you to achieve a fuller look without gaps. So just to go over the method again, what you need to do is insert the needle, place the hair on the hook, then close the hook, pull the crochet needle out, then insert the two strands of hair in between the loop that you have created. So that's it guys so as you can see this is how the wig looks like I'm going to fill up the spaces where i feel the hair is a bit void so this is how the hair looks finally i'm going to wear it just as it is on the wig cap with a shorter part on, at the back and then I'm going to proceed to trim my hair as I wear the wig. Please avoid to trim the hair on the dummy, but trim it when the wig is on your head so that you can achieve the desired length and the look that you want. So I really hope that you've enjoyed this tutorial. I was pretty much excited because this was my birthday. And remember to give this video a thumbs up. Remember to subscribe to this channel for more videos that have lined up for you this year. And I really hope you have a nice time. <music>